10 13 p.m in this box here can you guess what's in it this big old in this box that was that's what's in the box this month's packaging for a yellow nail polish i'm painting my nails yellow I'm excited. I've been very fixated on ensuring that I get yellow nail polish. This looks... Um... Okay, wait. Okay, wait. I'm annoyed. This is not the yellow I ordered. And even on this scan, on this barcode, I ordered the yellow Shine Be Mine. I received all fun and games. I'm not having fun. I'm not having fun with your little game. And this looks like much a much more pale yellow oh man i hope i can't really even really see because as you can tell i'm in i'm in the dark this is such a pale yellow um i'm kind of really disappointed this was supposed to be yeah, i just did the worst taste uh, not taste test i just i just did the worst sample but this was supposed to be such a bright vibrant yellow and they sent me all fun and games is this some, is this some type of sick joke amazon is this some sick joke should i proceed I'm gonna be looking at my nails all day tomorrow just knowing that this is not what this should have been. I think I'm gonna proceed and then return it and ask for the correct one. It's really annoying. I'm gonna use this as my tabletop. I, I'm just, this is such an inconvenient change of uh, yellow. It's minor, right? But it's not because this is not what I was expecting. And my nail painting job is becoming very, it's sloppy. The passion and desire to have my nails yellow, a nice vibrant, sunshine be mine yellow i lost my train of thought oh man oh my god i'm fucking up i just got yellow let me take a second i just got yellow nail polish on my ring this is not how it was supposed to go malfunction we're going we're moving forward yellow nails like a minion yellow nails do you like amphibians it's all fun and games the irony of this color and the audacity to put the label of the yellow that I wanted and the yellow that I got. They're like, oh, she won't even notice. I noticed because I purposely bought the sunshine yellow because that's the one that I wanted. First coat, down. This is where I'm at. I want to be excited, you know, but this is not what I was expecting. Dear God, make me a bird, so I can fly, fly far, far away. I'm kind of pressed because it's 10 p.m. and I wanted to paint my nails, right? And sure, we did it. Why would they do this to me? Why would they send me all fun and games? Like they're making some type of joke out of me. And I ordered Sunshine Be Mine. And then just try to blend it in there as if I wouldn't notice. Amazon takes me as a fool. Etsy. Do you take me as some type of fool? I just called you Etsy, actually, by accident. But you would think it was a small business on how disorganized the situation is. Not that small businesses are disorganized, but I just, I'm just saying like it's, it would be more acceptable because it's like a one-man job. And, um, you know, you can't always expect like top-notch quality from like a small business. Like it, it, it just leaves more space for error, in my opinion. If I'm ordering from a brand called Essie, E-S-S-I-E, -S -S -E, it's a pretty big nail polish company. And they sent me a pale yellow, and I wanted a bright, vibrant yellow. And this is funny because I talk a lot of shit about the color yellow. I call it abrasive. I tell yellow he can't stand alone like other colors can. I tell yellow that if he's going to be used in art, I mean, he needs to have pink or orange next to him. I tell Yellow that he only does well paired with another color. So maybe this is just the consequences of my my verbal expression, my take on the color Yellow. I'd say so. It's hard to be upset when I've said nothing but poor things about the color Yellow in the most recent time. Now the question is do I move forward and double coat it up? Double coat her up? Or do I just remove it all from my hands and kind of start over tomorrow or when I'm in a better headspace? Because when I go to sleep tonight, I can guarantee you these nails will have the imprint from my pillow 
from my hair, from my blankets, from the pressure of my body and head on my hands from sleeping. The chances of these looking proper in the morning are so low. Do we proceed? Do I give it a chance? Everybody deserves a chance. Let's go. I'm doing the second coat and I'm just going to, I'm going to try to focus a little bit more. I can't even turn this cap without looking at the top, reading all fun and games, without feeling like I'm being mocked. Yellow, I love you and I apologize for all the rude words I've said about you. We all can stand alone. Strong and high and we look good alone. I will say that we do pair really well with others too. I love your confidence, Yolo, and I love your creativity and your self-esteem and your radiance and how you can just steal the show. Okay, that is what I have for this nail polish. I was so hyped about it and I suppose it gets my yellow nail needs it will suffice until i get in sunshine be mine very sloppy nail job um they do look good in the camera aside from the fact that it's very sloppy i will stop being a little baby thanks for watching my video of me painting my nails yellow this turned out in a way that i had no i did not expect it to be like this the drama the drama all fun and games until you get the wrong yellow sent to you. This was a nail video using All Fun and Games by Etsy number 595. My name is Casey. Thank you for watching and I'll see you another time. Hopefully Sunshine Be Mine will arrive at my doorstep and be like, oh my god, it's me. This is who you wanted. This is what you were waiting for. Not that other guy, All Fun and Games. Talk to you later. Thanks for watching. Bye.